Well, okay, y'all niggas were screaming two weeks ago when Bill got the boot. So, like, niggas, y'all know what type of game it is. Like, white niggas give off some shit. Right. The black At the end of the day, I want all of them to die. It's nice. All of them want the burning hell. There's a video that surfaced on Twitter of this man that raped, I'm not going to even talk about it, but he raped. A, a young person in India, I believe, and they shot him in the streets. That's the new rule. Like if a dog. Like doing shit like that, they shoot them like a dog. And I appreciate it. Yeah, we need to go to Hammurabi next, dog. I'm serious. An eye for an eye. Let's go. An eye for an eye. Anyway, on to some lighter things. You're trying to educate you niggas in the streets, but Yeah, you know what I'm saying? We don't come with the jokes, though. We got a bunch of jokes. A bunch of jokes. Go for it. What's up? What you what you saw this week or heard this week? So G Herbo and Ari broke up. And I don't know if you don't know who G Herbo is. Oh, okay. He's a Chicago rapper. I know who he is. His girl, his, girl, his baby mama. How do y'all know her? Cause she's like famous on the Instagram. For what? Being his being girl. Her, being his girl and being cute as fuck. But no, she got, she got a weed line. Weed line. You know, you know, you know, you know, you know, you know, like we yeah, one, one of the five okay, items. So you know what? So basically, he's supposedly been cheating with Dum 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 Dum. Fabulous his stepdaughter. And oh, she saw him. Oh, she is bad. But she's a nice time. Yeah. So yeah. she saw she the face. But she saw him FaceTiming on an IG story of his homeboy. Oh, I didn't know that's how Right. Oh, so she's on the friends' side. Right. For all the niggas in the room. No, what the I don't know if I should call them shits. But, like, I, if you, that ain't your friend, you know, okay? That's some D'Angelo Russell shit. Like, yo, I caught you in this thing. You should go, yo, yo, yo. Because I'm watching everything in my bedroom. I'm close my friends. <laughs> Trying to make sure they titties not fitting crazy, like they eyes ain't cock out. You know, I'm looking at every little thing. So my thing is, how you not see this shit? Are you like low key trying to get caught up? And that's like, you know, people because it's both genders. Well, not really. It's black people cheating. But so people are cheating. Like people trying to hold your hold up. Let's try and go by. You're trying to hold your compadre down. So like, that's some real shady McGrady. That's some D'Angelo Russell shit. It is very shady. But McGrady. I like shady McGrady. We're gonna use that. The word. irony of it is, though, it happened to be on this fake. These fake holidays are created from Instagram. National Boyfriend Day. Oh, okay. she didn't find out on National Boyfriend, National Boyfriend Day. Day. But yeah. they came back strong with the you know, we've been single, you, you know, know fuck that shit. All right. So cool. If you've been single, what's, then bitch, why are you watching on his shit? Because so I still want to know. Was this year the inauguration of those holidays? Like, National Boyfriend Day, National Boyfriend Day? It's been National Taco Day. Because the nigga got in trouble. Right. Right. You know, it's National Boyfriend Day. Okay, I like, posted National Kid Day because, you know. Well, I guess, you know, some niggas was in their bag National Girlfriend Day. Okay. Some niggas weren't. Because I did see Cardi got the first Lambo truck that's ever in the Ooh, U.S. she did. And her nigga apparently still cheats, so whatever. Um, Kanye gave Kim a partnership with Yeezy and then a million dollars. She signed the contract. Yeah. Kanye. Because Balenciaga was coming for that ass. Okay. All I'm about to say is, you know, I know. They wanted Kim to do a deal because apparently they do like, they say it was the off brand. They didn't say what brand, but I'm assuming it's Balenciaga. They were going to give her like a deal or a line. And instead he said, babe, don't do that. And he gave her a million dollars. And a contract and a partnership with you. Yo, she's like, nigga, dude, I gave you my money back. Thank this, you. This you gave me the money you owed me. You still owe me on that. I'm going to be honest with y'all. I've watched the Kardashian for years. The Kardashians. <laughs> yeah, same. I'm not, I'm, 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 I know I'm, when Chris is about to set it up for somebody to get broke up with. Oh, she's about to the And for them to be saying all this shit about how Kim thinks Kanye is annoying and how she's sitting on the show talking to Chloe about how he's mad over right. like a band aid. Looking yes, good for my boy, so he better sit his ass down and shut the fuck up. They know how to leave the situation. They know how to leave it. To make you look like That's I used to do the shit wrong. To make you look like you doing the shit wrong, I know how to do That's it. I am a master at this shit. They can break up with you in their mind. They can just like, oh, you, nigga, you, uh, Yo, we some yeah. snakes. I'm saying. Ooh. No, I'm going to say, okay. I'm glad we said I'm going to say, I'm going to say that because shit. I went back and oh, listened to, I went back and listened to the Carter Five, right? And I was listening to Mona Lisa. And I also read that at the W Hotel downtown, there's been like 53 robberies. 
of What's women in Atlanta? in Atlanta of women robbing niggas, What's but we're about? set up. The duck right, but then you can listen to Mona Lisa and he's talking about like, yeah, I have my bitch set you up. You get drunk, you think you good. I know I've been to the house. That's like the oldest trick in the book. Though. I know. I would really like. No. Damn. There's no way. It's a lot of oh, we got we got a mic. Oh, uh, I, just, I live to your audience. There's a mic in the corner. Oh, no, 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 there's a lot of women there. Yo, as a woman, it's a lot of women there. Huh? Get on the shit. As a yo, as a woman, as a woman, as a woman, y'all just know the power y'all feel. You know what I'm saying? Some women don't. That's the problem. That's why they out here. That's that's why Remy said thoughts and groupies should be um get some, some some sort of punishment. I don't think so because let them live. You're the wife and the happy wife. You're in the house with your happy husband and your happy marriage. Then be that. Don't down these girls because they ain't taking these niggas too seriously. Every nigga ain't like your nigga, so don't sit there and be like, oh. These thoughts and these, they ain't really what you think they are. They just having fun and they and, and doing whatever the fuck. But the ones that are, are intentionally conniving to destroy a man's career. Yeah, and these niggas sometimes are intentionally conniving to women all the fucking time and they don't get no kind of get back. And the only way that you can get back is that they ask and they copy. So my thing is, hey, I don't care. Blank man. <laughs> Shout out to Nike. You gotta know. That's why these people are not divorcing these women. Guess why? It's cheaper to keep her. It hurts their fucking life. I mean, also, your granddaddy, great granddaddy, niggas just had separate rooms in the crib. So, yo, you wanna do your thing, you got your shit down the street, and all that. Don't fuck with me, nigga, like, because we gonna hold us down together, though. Like, it's what family's been doing that for. 30 times. Forever, dog, like. But they also been getting so they don't know how to really take care of two families at no So I'm not going to go for you trying to have a damn family down the street. Well, you ain't even took care of damn home you got right here. I wish the fuck you would. But what if he is going to put down the home? Yeah. And I'm having boyfriend and you do whatever. Word. And I'm having a boyfriend and you do whatever. So you, it looks like you used to be giving the niggas the kid kind of a big. I'm a big. I want my man that's in California. I'm a reference to Sex in the City. Get your man. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We're going to uh, timestamp this. Go ahead. Right. Timestamp this. <laughs> it is. All right. Okay, I have to do damage control. Yeah, go, go ahead real quick. No, that was the damage control. Oh. <laughs> <laughs>